Hey guys, my name is Femi or Jeremy and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get the gestures working on your trackpad of your hacking touch. And it's really simple, all you have to do is to install some texts. All of the gestures are working right from your point and click gestures, your scroll and zoom gestures and the more gestures. Gestures like your three finger swipe up to open your mission control, your three finger swipe down to open your app expose, launchpad gestures and more. Force click also works too but not in the same way as Max. If you should click on the folder, it will mimic the first click feature on Real Max. But other than that, everything else works very well. Not as good as Real Max. It's not as smooth or as fluid as what a Real Mac will feel like. But at least it's better than nothing and it's working and that's all that's important. Before we get into this video, make sure you like and subscribe and turn on post notifications to know when I post new videos. With all that said, let's get into the video. Okay, to install it is very simple. All we will need are these three files here and I'll be linking them down below in the description. So when you have downloaded them, open up this application called Hacking Tool. We will be using it to disable the Gatekeeper function which is basically there to block you from touching your system files. So head over to the Tools tab and come down here and click on this house icon. Then put in your password and hit enter. Then hit OK. So it will run a little code for you here in the background and when it's done, you can close this up. Next, let's open this app called Kext Utility. This is what we'll be using to install the Kext we have downloaded. So put in your password and hit enter. Now the app will load for a while. You'll see this loading sign down here and it will keep loading. It might take a while, so just be patient and let it finish its job. Okay, so now that it's done, you'll see a little message down below showing that it's done. What you have to do next is to drag the Kext into this Kext Utility app but there are two of them here and any of them could work for you for me both of them worked and it unlocked all the gestures for me but for some of you ps2 controller will work that's if your keyboard is running on ps2 and voodoo i2c will work if your keyboard is running on something else i'm not really sure of mine i do know mine is a synaptic touchpad though for the voodoo i2c folder open it and you see a group of hex there you have to install this voodoo i2c hex and any one of these other ones depending on the type of touchpad you have mine is a synaptic touchpad and i am to select this one and this one i read online on a forum and somebody said that this one which is supposed to be for windows precision trackpads and it worked for that synaptic trackpads but if you have a synaptic trackpad like me just install this one and install this one and you can drag it into the Kext Utility app. But note, if you have different touchpads, make sure you select the one that is compatible with your touchpad, whether it's Elan or it's Synaptics. But just make sure that this Voodoo I2C and either one of this one, respective to your computer, must be installed. Okay, so to close this folder now, the second option, if this Kext in this folder don't work for you, is to use this Voodoo PS2 controller Kext. Here, you can just simply drag the Kext into the Kext Utility app again and when you do so, put in your password and hit enter. Now the app will install the text for you and run some processes in the background. Just be patient again and let it finish its job. When it's done, you will get a message at the end showing you it's all done and you can close it up and restart your computer. So when you restart your computer, you can go into your system preferences and select your trackpad settings. And when you open it, you will notice all the settings there and you will know your trackpad is working according to the particular gesture that is listed there. All your gestures will be there including this option here over in the more gestures tab and you can swipe down to enter app expose or swipe up to open mission control or pinch in to open your launch pad and out to show your desktop and many more so that was it for this video if it was helpful make sure you give it a like you subscribe to see more videos like this turn on post notifications to know when i post new videos thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time bye